The surreal scene from the Arc de Triomphe, with police sweeping through Saturday night to prevent rioting on the iconic Champs-Élysées. And this is a calmer scene in Paris, a calmer night compared to the nights before. Imagine if that had happened to my brother, my little or my big brother, in the street because he refused to stop. I mean, we're not safe here. We should be safe with the police, but we're scared of them. Emotions are still raw after the killing of the 17-year-old Nahel M. Tuesday morning, with accusations that police are trigger-happy towards young people of Arab or African descent. Mourners gathered for Nahel's funeral Saturday afternoon in the Paris suburb of Nanterre, French leaders promised to restore calm after nights of rioting. I think that everyone has understood that the state will not back down. I think, and let me say here, that the message of responsibility over youth given to parents is very important. The riots across France after Nahel's killing, of course, come out of a context. On one hand, a French ethos of seeing citizens as individuals, not defined by religion or ethnic group. On the other hand, a felt reality by minorities that the ethos is a bluff, that discrimination exists. The riots getting attention in Israel as well. We have seen all going attacks over the past few days against Jewish targets. We strongly condemn these attacks and we give back the French government in its struggle against the plague of any French President Emmanuel Macron canceled a planned state visit to Germany. But the issues raised in recent days transcend Macron and go to the heart of France's identity itself.